up at a checkpoint or something, did you? I'm inside the clinic waiting for you. Sorry, Alex. I'll be there as soon as I can. Hope you're not losing sight of what's important here. Sorry, this place just brings back memories. Don't take too long. Make the best of it, he says. What a job. Got to hand it to Nathaniel Brown. Even though his company is pro org Santo has managed to keep its excellent reputation. And his policy of hiring org laborers is genius. Low-income org housing was a very lucrative business for a while. The org rights whiners didn't like it, of course, but who gives a shit? They do the work of three people, you pay them half as much, and they don't complain because they can't get work anywhere else. It's an opening. In the hands of irresponsible journalists, it can be. Hello. Wait, were you followed here? What? What do you mean? You can't be too careful. They have eyes everywhere. Right. And I suppose you have all I need to make sure they stay out of my business, right? I do. But don't let the shop fool you, it is only a sideline. I mainly sell parts, raw materials, you know, the, the sort of thing you can use to make something else. Listen, you look familiar, have we met before? No, I'm pretty sure I'd remember. I wouldn't. I get occasional memory loss, ever since the incident. I got rid of my AUG right after that. Inner ear implant used to help me with my balance, but now I just hear ringing all the time. Do you hear that? Hear what? Never mind, anyway. Let's change the subject. You want some of those special ingredients I mentioned? I think I'll be on my way. Sure, sure. But uh, before you go, you don't by any chance have any neuropozin you can spare, do you? Why do you need it if you're not augmented anymore? My brain still thinks I am. Some joke, huh? So, uh, can you can you help me out? Sure, here you go. Thanks. You're all right, you know that? A real friend. You should go down to my basement and have a look around. I've got some cool stuff down there. Also known as the human restoration act. This legislation is passed. Just back it up. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiate. Access granted.
Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. North Gate leads through the remains of the fortification that surrounded Staremestu, more commonly known as the Old City. The wall itself was brought down in the 13th century, at least where it wasn't incorporated into the surrounding infrastructure. Prague has always taken pride in embracing progress, but also valuing the past. This plaza also offers a view of the river and the opposite bank, as well as the best view of one of the most distinctive buildings in Prague, the Palisades Glade. How is that for merging the old and the new? It certainly is an interesting looking building. Personally, I think it is one of the most distinctive buildings in the world. But being a native, I may be slightly biased. It certainly makes Bolzano Plaza a popular spot for visitors and locals. I assume that statue is of the Bolzano? Yes, Bolzano Plaza is named after Bernard Bolzano. More precisely, Bernard Placidus Johann Nepomuk Bolzano. Now that is a mouthful. Bolzano was an early 19th century philosopher and mathematician notable for his works The Theory of Science, The Paradoxes of the Infinite, The Textbook of the Science of Religion, and a number of other treatises I haven't read. And <laughs> don't worry, there will not be a test after the tour. Okay, have a look around. There are a number of interesting shops in the area. If you have any questions, ask, and don't wander too far. We'll continue the tour when you are all ready. Granted. Granted. Yeah, 
Hey, glad you could make it. Any trouble getting away? Miller's been giving me some leeway, but not much. I did survive a terror attack. You and me both. God, sometimes I really hate the city. It used to welcome people like us, go out of its way to entice Ogs to live here. This clinic was built because Prague saw us as its future. Now, look at it. Times change, Alex. I know, trust me, even got the scars to prove it. We've been working together for a few months now. I still don't know much about you. What, you trolling for my secrets now? Just the good ones. How did you join the Juggernaut Collective? Well, they got me out of a tough spot. Before the incident. I was working for Bell Tower flying VIPs around Panama and I stumbled into something big. Something very important people didn't want anyone to know about. So, they ordered Bell Tower to kill me. Janus warned you? Got you out? A friend of Janus's, someone in the Collective who used to work for Bell Tower too. You don't mess with these people, Adam. Not by yourself. I learned that the hard way. You're a valuable asset. The Collective could have sent you anywhere. Why Prague? You really need to ask? Ever since the incident, paranoia and racism are eating the city alive. The whole world's watching just to see how Prague handles its AUG problem. Didn't realize the entire Collective was pro-AUG. Not everyone is. But we all know our real enemies need chaos to operate in. Play the right chord, pull the right string, and Prague has plenty of that. You said we got something? Yeah, listen to this. A little heads up would have been nice. Sending your team to Dubai was my call, but now we need to go by the book. Focus on Ark. You want me to pin all of this on them? The bombings in Prague, the break-in at Besselife, and Dubai? Officially, all five attacks involved augmented terrorists. Is that clear? Yes, sir. But send me the reports if you want me to prove it. Because ARC don't operate in North America. They're setting up ARC, Adam. They sent you into that ambush in Dubai, and now they want to pin everything on the Augmented Rights Coalition. I told you Miller was dirty. Sounds to me like Miller's following orders. It also sounds like he's not happy about it. All right, whatever. Maybe he's just a stooge. You can't say the same about the man he's talking to. His boss, Joseph Manderley. Director of TF-29 operations worldwide. The only person at Interpol higher than him is the General Secretariat. We need to play this smart, Alex. Think about what we heard. What was that bit about VersaLife? You mean the break-in that never happened? Yeah, I started digging into that right after I decrypted the conversation. What'd you find? Like I said, man, it's the break-in that never happened. VersaLife is one of the biggest pharma companies on the planet, the only one still manufacturing neuropazine. If it got broken into, it would have been big news. So why are they saying it did? VersaLife doesn't produce just neuropazine. They've got a huge research and development division. Yeah? So? What does that have to do with ARC? Why frame them for breaking? They want them to look like terrorists. I guess it depends on what they'll say was stolen. See what the Collective can dig up. If this really is a conspiracy, that break-in will be the threat to pull on. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna finish my investigation. Find out who really bombed the station. I'll let you know when I turn up. Same here. Good luck, Adam. Miller, we still going to Gollum City? You are. Meet me at Kopecki's puppet shop. Your pilot's en route. I'll brief you there. Copy that.
That's Just make it, it. through this shift. Rozšířit po celé Evropě. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Initiated. Access granted. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Nobody wants to get too close to me. One step at a time. Just remember that. Are we really doing oh. any good? Hello. Of runaways live down in the sewers, this shift. form their own little community. That's just a rumor. It can't be real. 
Who cares if it isn't? It's romantic. Bad Unwanted when he was misfits just drugs. banding together and carving out a place for themselves. Erica, you need to grow up. Can't defend against that kind of thing. Sounds like some crazy pseudo religion. Whatever. I don't think I've met either of them yet. I've lived in Prague my whole life. Never seen it this bad. I'm telling you, I hear whispers in the wall. They speak the truth. You sure it's not in your head, brother? Shh! Beep, beep, clack, clack, typing, computers, don't you hear it? I don't hear anything. Granted. Agenda, big global impact story. Then segue into earthquakes and clones, follow up on Dubai, and finish with Loki. Where are we on Rahar Wars? You're asking all the right questions. Still needs an ending. Well, you said that place is the front for a front. I want to know more. I want facts. Bones, what about you? I still think we should lead with Moonbase. He's right. Moon base is sexy. But since when are we trying to be sexy? Do I look like Eliza Kazan to any of you? You absolutely do not. Deep breaths, people. Let's take a minute to think about who we are, what it is we're trying to accomplish here. Don't shoot! Shit. We're journalists! Who invited the agent type? Who are you? What do you want? Why are you here? You, you hear it because of the Dubai story? Well, the article about the moon base? The, the, the clones? The, the clones on the moon base? Who sent you? I'm here for Sam's dad. You in charge? I take charge, but I'm not in charge, man. No one owns or detects the truth. Freedom of information is a collective right, man, and, the, and the collective responsibility. That said, you gonna break someone's nose? You break my nose. I didn't come here to break anything. I just need you to cooperate. I spent my 20s in a commune, man. I'm all about cooperation. Good. It's about something you've been looking into. It's making some people nervous. What do you know about Praha Dovos? That little import company? I know there's more than boxes in the basement. We've seen agent types come in and out. The place is a curtain. The first in a series of men. Pull them all back and you'll find... them. Tell me I'm wrong. It's a dead end. <laughs> right. Guys like you always come down here because of dead ends. Fine. 
Then what if it's something other people are already looking into? If someone like you makes too much noise, that may compromise any chance they have of uncovering something bigger. Do you understand? <laughs> I'm supposed to believe we're colleagues now? No men in black types you walk into Pike's newsroom, tell them to be hush-hush about something, and they do it. But that's not how it works here. One day, you will all be exposed. If not by me, then someone just like me. Sam is that isn't one voice. K isn't one man. What exactly do you do down here? Sammy's death is a media uprising. While Pikes panders to corporate tyranny and government bullshit, we pump out the truth. We uncover it, we write it, we publish it, we get our noses broke for it. So you print pamphlets? Well, we do a lot more than that. We got ways of getting into Pikes media network. That's how we disseminate information. Information you get by hacking into places you shouldn't. The truth is buried. If digging it up means skirting a few rules, so be it. What did you mean when you said K wasn't one man? K is an ideal, the intangible leader of tangible resistance. You can kill me, but then little K would become K. Kill little K and, and Bones over there becomes K. That's There's always a K. And what if you kill Bones? <laughs> you can't kill Bones, man. Bones isn't real. I think he was one of them. He was supposed to be a prince of Belgium, man, but then he broke his condition. We found him inside this fucking cult, all confused, so we reprogrammed him with the truth. Right. Suppose I needed to make a deal with Sam's dad. There's no one person I can talk to? Depends on the deal. I mean, there's always going to be an editor. Editor makes the final call on all published material. That would be me. So you could ensure that something doesn't get talked about? Depends on the deal. I need you to stop looking into Prahandovos, but not for the reason you assume. Relax, I get it. You don't think I do, but I do. You've got to appease your military industrial masters. We've all been there, man. I'm not who you think I am. The kinds of people who manipulate the news, who cover things up. You don't need to convince me that's who the enemy is. The enemy is anyone who conceals the truth. And that's exactly what you're asking me to do. To pretend like that little import company isn't hiding something. I'm asking you to see a difference between conspiracy and discretion. Between people who hide information in order to push their own agendas, and those who need to stay off the radar in order to do their jobs. You of all people should understand. Okay. Okay, look. You seem like a reasonable guy, huh? Hell, I've usually been punched by now. I find this refreshing. Here's the deal. We promise to forget all about Praha Dovos and stay out of your way as long as you give us something better. What do you suggest? The only thing I hate more than secret organizations are toothless media conglomerates who don't hold anyone accountable, who spit lie after lie after lie. So I propose a trade. There are places my people can't get into. You get into one of those places and find me some dirt on the real enemy here. Pikes Media. Do that, and I'll cut whatever you want me to cut. Who knows? Maybe you'll even learn something. You're gonna forget everything you know about Praha Dovos for now. It's the only way you get to protect your ideals. <laughs> right, because concealing information is obviously the best way to keep people informed. You really think I'm that stupid? There's this word you might want to look up. It's called transparency. It means people have the right to know, no matter what the cost. Fair enough. But there's a difference between speculation and fact. Right now I'm betting you don't have anything tangible to go on. You don't know who I am, what my role is, or what's really going on. Wait until the facts are out before you go spewing misinformation everywhere. Before you get people killed. Okay, maybe I don't have all the facts yet, I'll give you that, but I know something's going on down there. Otherwise, you wouldn't be here. That's why you always have to keep digging. The truth, the real truth, it's a rare fucking bird, man. And if you're too slow or too careful, it fucking flies off. So when I get so much as a hint of truth, I strike when I can, as hard as I can. Whatever the cost, is that it? You want to be better than Pikus, right? But what does Pikus do? They frighten people. They sensationalize the news, they misdirect. If you want to resist them, you need to strive to be objective. 
You need to deal in truths. And the truth is, putting Braha Dovos under the spotlight right now is dangerous to me and useless to the public. Wait until it's time. Okay, okay, I get it. I don't want to compromise no one's investigative journalism. Sometimes you move too fast and the real story flies off before you even had a chance to see it. That's not what we do here. So you go break open whatever it is you're breaking open and we'll lay off Braha Dovos. For now. You're making the right choice. We'll see. You know, we could still use your help, though. Journalistic integrity may not mean very much topside, but it still means something down here. And that's why I think you should help us. You're our best shot at hitting the mass media where it hurts. All right, what do you want to know about Pikes? I want skeletons, the kind that companies like Pikes come all the way to Prague just to bury. Corporate archiving, man. Corporate archiving, huh? You asking me to break into a bank? I'm not talking vaults here. Ashani Talvar, the Palisade CEO, she leverages her clients, keeps information about them close at hand. She's got something on Pikes, I know it. I just can't get to it, but I bet you could. You poke into her office, find something that proves how nasty Pikes is, how much they love to piss on the truth, and I promise you this, I'll misplace any file you want. We'll see. Chang, you there? What do you got for me? Took care of Sam's dad. No one's going to be reading anything about us anytime soon. Oh, I'll cancel the movers. How'd you do it? I've reasoned with them. They're not going to give us any trouble. Reasoned? With the conspiracy nuts. I know what I'm doing. I finally got through to my contact in the trade office. He said, fuck off. Keep trying, boy. Keep giving them help. Will you please stop trying to enlist me in your activism? Org rights is no different from gay rights, women's rights, or any other kind. We have to wake people up, shake them out of their indifference. I agree with everything you are saying, but believe it or not, I have other priorities in my life. I work in a soup kitchen twice a month, I collect blankets, I donate to charities. I do enough already. Granted. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Problems already. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted.
initiated. Access granted. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. I'm always telling you, Hano, people in all country are more genuine. They treat each other with respect. If a man has something to say, he says it to your face. Politely, that is what... Rest. Go away, Clegg. We're closed. Oh, he is not here to gamble, Hano. Are you? You're Otar? I am Mr. Botcovelli, yes. Who are you? I'm here on behalf of a concerned third party. Oh, you hear that, Mano? Our guest is a very private person. I found it pays to be cautious when you don't know exactly who you're dealing with. That is true. But sometimes it can create the problems which could have been avoided had they been more forthcoming. If neither man is willing to compromise, they cannot reach a satisfactory understanding. I would like to avoid any misunderstandings. Good. So in this case, since you already know my name, and no doubt are other things about me. I think you owe me the same courtesy. I'm with Interpol, but I'm not here to cause any trouble. Organized crime is someone else's department. I'm here to pick up the shipment you're withholding from Vaclav Kohler. Vano, look. The only honest policeman in Prague. Kohler must want this item very much to send someone like you. But I will tell you what I told Kohler. No, he cannot have the calibrator, and you can't either. Dealing with Ogs is bad business. A point which some people in this organization have yet to understand. Kohler didn't send me. 
I volunteered after he explained his situation. Sounded like he can use a little help. The truth is, though, I'm doing this for me. I need some repairs done, and Kohler needs the calibrator to do them. You believe this, Madvano? Such commitment to honesty. But now I wonder about your commitment to other people. But tell me, Mr. Frenchman. How far are you willing to go to help out a friend in need? If someone needs my help, I give it. Any way I can. <laughs> it is like I am always telling him you can get a lot accomplished just by having a conversation. I will let you have the calibrator. Thanks. And what's it gonna cost me? You listen to the man, Vano. Even when he gets what he wants, he does not trust it. But what shall we do with such a man? What will it cost? A favor. What kind of favor? Uh, don't worry. Mm. I will let you know in due time. It won't be too painful. Not for you. <laughs> so what do you say? Do we have a deal, mister? Jensen. We have a deal. Excellent. Upstairs, in my office, you will find Collar's Calibrator. I will be in touch. Don't like being so close to one of them. You have orders. Follow them. <sighs> Get out of here, freak! Now! Nothing but a memory of what a human should be. Mr. Botcavelli knows what he is doing. Relax. It's not your problem. All right, Kohler. I've got your neuroplasticity calibrator. That's great! I'm gonna pencil you in for that optimization procedure. Just as soon as I'm done with this house call. What house call? I got this other client, you know, doesn't like to be kept waiting. Neither do I, Kohler. Call me when you're ready. Took up residence in the neighboring Udalek complex. Dr. Robert Kring is the What do you mean you think he'd make a better capo? Mr. Nicolazzi, he is a great man. This family, it is where it is because of him. Of course, but what do you expect? The Diwali family has lost a lot of respect in the last few years. Bah! What do you know of anything?
access granted. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. 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 Access granted. However, this particular building was completed in 2024, and since then has acted as the head office. Very impressive. It has also been recognized as a heritage site. Absolutely. You're welcome to go inside and visit. Well, the lobby at least, it does remain a bank. Restricted areas are off limits. 
Of course. Unless I decide to open an account. <laughs> Thank you. Pleasure, sir. I'm sure the receptionist will be happy to answer any questions you might have. Sir? So the bank doesn't store money or gold or anything, it only stores data? That's right, in any form it takes. Hard drives, archival papers, prototypes, proprietary research, sensitive items. So if I want to find out all about a company's dirty secrets, or commit industrial espionage, all I have to do is break into Palisade Bank? That's not as easy as you think, believe me. And even if you do pull off that miracle, you'll have to look over your shoulder for the rest of your life. That's a promise. Welcome to Palisade Property Bank. Absolutely secure. Data extractors have never breached the number. <clears throat> Hackers are everywhere. Not here? Exactly. Of course, physical security is also paramount, and Tarvos has an impeccable reputation. They were affiliated with Bell Tower, yes? Formerly, yes, but so were most security companies before the incident. Why don't I schedule a meeting for you with our accounts manager? He can answer all your concerns and start the application process. Hmm, yes. Why don't we do that? Thank you. <laughs> a pleasure, sir. Hello, sir. Welcome to Palisade. May I help you? Not sure. Never been to a property bank? I see. Well, we are the premier secure corporate archive in the world. We offer a number of services, including ultra-secure corporate vaults, as well as executive safes for smaller accounts. Exclusivity, anonymity, and security are the cornerstones and our greatest selling point. Makes sense that security is a major concern for your clients. Oh, yes. Everything at Palisade is state-of-the-art. Security measures are audited regularly, and Tavos is a very well-respected private security firm. Would there be anything else? So, this is a data haven? Well, <laughs> we don't use that term here, but yes. We archive highly sensitive materials and documents for some of the most powerful businesses and people in the world. No worries about corporate espionage here. Or government subpoenas. Our international clientele do tend to uh, disagree with the stance of their local governments as it pertains to uh, corporate rights, let's say. So they take advantage of this country's more pro-business legislation? Mm -hmm. uh, I suppose that's one way of looking at it, if you were a cynic. I prefer to think that our clients shouldn't have to deal with small-minded anti-capitalist bureaucracies if they can avoid it. How big are the corporate vaults? Doesn't seem like this building would hold that many. Oh, quite big in fact. We call them container vaults. Like shipping containers. Our storage facility is actually right under our feet. Quite an impressive sight. Underground makes sense. Great security feature. Absolutely. In addition, they are only visited by appointment and require the use of a client's keycard to access. Your executive safes are available to anyone? Well, we do have an exclusive clientele and the application process is rigorous. Despite this, almost all our safes are currently occupied. Your client list must be very impressive. It is. Mostly they are held by executives from our client companies, but some select individuals have been approved as well. But with the same high security standards, I hope. Oh, of course. And access to the executive safe room is restricted. Clients must use their assigned personalized keycards to gain entry. That's all? Sounds a little simple. It's a little bit more involved. The keycard also switches off all automated security measures within the vault. Lasers and sentries and the like. 
all very high tech. I think I'd like to see the account manager. I'm sorry, Mr. Romanek is unavailable at the moment. Thanks for the information. Check that out. Granted. Granted. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. This is Eliza Kassan, reporting to you live from Pikes. Ariel is Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Back to New York. And a more in-depth look at UN Security Council Resolution 3507, also known as the Human Restoration Act. This legislation, if passed, calls for the removal and downgrading of all overly powerful, unlicensed augmentations. Individuals who... ...comply will be arrested and relocated to designated AUG-only locations. Safety is the primary concern. Especially in the wake of the AUG. 
incident where millions of people lost their lives due to malfunctioning organizations. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Only widened the gap and polarized the dialogue on both sides of the issue. We will be watching the UN closely for any break in the story. This is Eliza Kazan reporting to you live from Pikus. <laughs> Sub-level security room has their up-to-date security password. Well, I'm here with Please see the receptionist. Can't defend against that kind of thing. Come soon enough. Hands of irresponsible journalists. It can be. Underground websites and radio stations continue. An elusive group of vigilante hackers are exposing big corruption. What these journalists overlook, however, is the damage these hackers leave in their wake. Last year, the collective shut down London's traffic grid, causing gridlock for hours and preventing life-saving medical transports from getting through. In Chile, they committed massive voter fraud when they rigged the electronic voting system and elected the 24th boy as president. It spread throughout Europe. The shopkeeper was late on his protection payments, so my client beat him to death with a baseball bat. In front of a cop? How are you going to spin that one in court? I don't have to. The police officer is prepared to Jak testify that it was self-defense. The shopkeeper pulled the knife on my client first, and during the altercation the knife fell through a sewer grate. Oh, I get it. Your client and the cop have a um, pre-existing business arrangement. Nice. Talk to me. If Go back to Utrek, who you're back. Welcome, welcome. Nice gear you've got here. All high-end. And you look like you know high-end. Which biotech did your job? Not Isolé. They don't come in black. You try this on all your customers? Just the ones made of carbon fiber. As one enthusiast to another, you can tell me. Gonna have to disappoint you. Maybe you can make it up to me. You look like the kind of man who might have access to breach software. That stuff's illegal. Come on, man, don't play around. You know why it's illegal. You know the world governments don't want us to find out their dirty secrets. But we will, and you can help us. Be part of the revolution. Anyway, just think about it. All the details are in the computer. Want to have a look? To sell or to buy? Sure. Great. Go ahead. In yet another 
That's not just a display. They're for sale. Nothing for me. Don't wait for planned obsolescence. Now that's interesting. It's like stepping back in time. Even the owner is an antique. I did go in once, just to see. But I ran right out again because I came face to face with this creepy looking og woman. That would be the old man's daughter. He adores her. I can't for the life of me Hello? understand why. Hi, Matka. You're kidding. No, I'm fine. A man I'm trapped fine, in the past said... has a fanatical transfer. I wasn't in the daughter. train station when it happened. I bet Sunday dinner at no, their house I is don't. lots of fun. The bank is nowhere near the train Damn station. Nox. You live in a town with a population of 800 people, but here things are more spread out. I gotta go. Give my best to town. Love you. Bye. Rather stay quiet. Spanish flu. That's impossible. We eradicated Spanish flu decades ago. Until yesterday, I would have agreed with you. But I've got a dead four-month-old boy whose cells are telling me something different. If it were making a comeback, the CDC would have told us. And VersaLife would already be manufacturing a cure. Don't be paranoid. I think I'm lost. smart home system. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Access granted. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Hobos, Augs, prostitutes. I've lived in Prague my whole life. Never been? seen it this bad. E Legislation is 
So, you got anything on Picus? What are you working on right now? What's your big story? We don't write stories, man. We bombard with facts. 63% of all earthquakes since 1997 were caused by geological bombs. D did you know that? You must have missed that one. There is nothing natural about these disasters. You like figures? 7.1 million Ogs left in the world. That's down 89% since the incident. Darknet Chatterman up 73% since that thing in Dubai. It's all related. You want a spoiler? You want the bottom line? I'll tell you. All part of a selective depopulation agenda they've had from the beginning. The means change, the targets change, but not the ideal. And our governments, they know about this, but the public has no idea. Why? Why is that? Because Pikes controls 94% of the world's media, and 97% of what they report is complete bullshit! That's a fact. You mentioned something about Dubai. What do you know about what happened there? <laughs> ex belt our mercenaries working with local Slavic gangsters caught in the middle of a puppet show in the Middle East? The whole thing was carefully crafted for you. Crafted by who? Someone who likes to rig the game. Puppet on each hand, man. Where do you get this information from? Who's your source? Voices in the dark, man. The moment you fall asleep is the moment they start talking. Psst, Kidara, Kilva, the Changala. That's what I hear. Whispers out of reach. It's, a, it's like a scent. Something no one can hold on to yet. So you have no idea? I got plenty of ideas, but the more I talk, the less I can hear. Besides, journalistic integrity, man. We're not pikers down here, okay? We're one of the few media outlets left that aren't part of the global control mechanism. Indirect means on one side, direct means on the other. And once you're in the wheels of the machine, you're finished! I think I found the kind of information you're looking for. All right. Inspire me. Here. Pikus knew all about a recent chemical spill and what it did to the water supply. They warned their own people, but not the public at large. Better to risk people's health than to threaten social order. This is good. Very good. Anything else? A commercial airliner went down recently over an ionospheric research facility. The plane went down because of whatever the military was doing there, not because of some augmented passenger like Pikus claims. Shit, man! This is it! This is headline fucking material! You did good, man! Real good! Anything else? No, that's it. Uh, that's cool, man. Uh, this should be more than enough. Okay, uh, Bones has been typing up a storm already. We pulled all our Pikus theories together and laid out some preliminaries. If you did your job right, this should help fill in the blanks. So we're done here. Almost. We need to make sure this issue gets the publicity it deserves. There's a city information hub we want you to hack. It's on your way out, I promise.
unbiased and impartial reporting. And now for a close look. <laughs> Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. I always get a little nervous when I go into the subway. Enough problems already. Anomaly detected. Access granted. Milana, I got into the art permit registry. Hold on. That should give me access now as well. Why am I seeing a security timer? Probably because neither of us have done this before. Cross your fingers. I borrowed this employee ID from a guy in a bar. Why does it say there's only one validation slot? Shit, shit, shit! The city has quotas for this kind of thing. Prague is designed to regulate people to death. What does that mean? The system won't let this guy register two people. Just... scan something. There isn't much time. Help one person at least. Good. Irenka's documents should hold up to any kind of scanning check now. She's as legit as she can be without actually being legit. I came here to help two people. It doesn't always work that way. Look, you need to get out of there, please. Elena, that permit I wasn't able to scan. What happens to Edward now? He probably ends up in Golem. Or he gets arrested for trying to use fake documentation. Thrown into a cell somewhere. I don't know. Doesn't exactly feel like a win. Does it? No, it doesn't. I don't like we did the best we could. Listen, thanks for being one of the good guys. Granted. Okay, you there? Who is this? How to get this number? I did what you asked. Sam is that should have no problem getting its message out now. You remember our deal? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't compromise whatever little game you're playing over at that import company. Try to keep a low profile. If Picus wasn't gunning for you before, they will be now. Uh, don't worry. Just make sure you remember who the good guys are. Access 
access granted. Be a beautiful city. Now look. What is this city coming to? Look at this. Look at this. Is this? This lake could use some help. the room with questions with doubts he contributes nothing he may say nothing i'm gonna say a few things whether you want me to or not we got a lot to talk about richard now that we can finally talk why have you what is it that offends you so much about our attempt to construct something better you mean your attempt to control people amplifying your hypnotic techniques with some kind of social enhancer Keeping people from talking back, from questioning you. I don't think you understand. Please. These... These people want to be here. We need each other. How ugly must the world have looked to you to go to these lengths? To actually believe that this was some kind of alternative? I... We... We chose to start over, to escape what society had become, what it was turning us into. You may not understand, but they do. No, I understand. You sought out people who were vulnerable. People like you, who had reasons to run away. Who do you think they are? There are no missing persons reports. I didn't rip them from warm meals and bamboo linen. For those who wander the sewers at night in search of answers and alternatives, this is as good as it gets. No more hiding, no more running away, 
No more feeling abandoned. They need me. They need somewhere to feel welcome. And the ones you don't welcome? Those who try to question or resist, like Viznik, like me? You have no problem rejecting them, threatening them, installing gun turrets to ensure they can never pull back the curtain. The guns exist only to protect the ideal. Even the most peaceful communities must be prepared to defend themselves. This isn't a community. It's a magic trick. You've been hypnotizing people, selling them on some fantasy of what you wish the world was like. He... he tricked us? I don't understand. None of it meant anything. Please, don't leave. He can undermine me all he wants, but he can't change what it's like up there. The decommissioning, the segregation. They will round you up and catalog you. They will do worse. People need to be guided. Now more than ever. All these things you're trying to run away from, trying to pretend away, no one should have to face them alone. But this isn't guidance. This is just replacing one totalitarian nightmare with another. I... I went too far. He preyed on us. By a few thousand miles, yeah. And it's time to turn around now, Richard. Time to shut all of this off. I don't understand. How could we do that? I believe in what we were trying to do. Richard can no longer persuade anyone of anything. The others are free of him now, just like you are. I'm not a model of separation. I questioned him, and then I... I'm not one of them anymore. But I'm not... not one of them. You were right to question him. The fact that you were able to at all when others couldn't says a lot about your strength of character. I... 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 I became I again. Temporary signal failure led them to perceive me as a threat. I started thinking differently. I realized how... how... how there's... there's two eyes in Viznik. That's when I figured it all out. It's a good thing you did. God knows how far this might have gone if Richard had been left unchecked. How many others might have come and been persuaded to stay? We came to him because... because we didn't fit the so... So social schematic, hounded by laws, hated by revolutions. He offered a way out, but there is no way out. Exile from exile is exile. You're out now, Viznik. There should be nothing more drawing you to this place, to him. You can go anywhere you want. You can do anything you want. I want to be... I want to be... I am alone.
access granted. Who are you? How the hell did you get in here? This is a restricted lab. A neon lab, isn't that right? I've seen what your drug does to Augs. Hmm. Maybe I should call in the guards, hmm? You can discuss the ethics of neon with them. Give me one good reason not to trigger the alarm. For starters, because I can move a lot faster than you. So how about neither of us do anything rash just yet? What is it you expect from me? I'm just a chemist here. You make a product that kills people. I'm not leaving until that's no longer possible. And you're gonna help me. Why would I help you? People have a right to... to disconnect from the world. To do whatever they want to their minds, their bodies. I see no reason why that should stop. Things in Prague aren't exactly looking up right now. I'm not saying Neon is responsible for that, but it certainly isn't helping. Not me, not you, not anyone. Now as resourceful as I may be, you know this lab better than I do. I'm asking for your help. You're right. Recreational drug use is not the reason the world is falling apart. If anything, riding the rainbow is one of the few things still... still holding some of us up. Why take that from me? Why take it from anyone? I'm not convinced I actually need your help. It's pretty obvious that all I have to do is shoot a couple of these tanks. Any monkey with a gun can do that. You mean the reactors? You're not serious, are you? You wouldn't actually be that reckless. Would you? Why not? I'm here to halt the production of Neon, sabotage this whole operation. I think my way sounds pretty good. Your way would kill us all! Please, for everyone's sake, you have to rethink your plan. Please. I'm overthinking all this. I'm asking some high school chemistry dropout for information she probably doesn't even have access to. Information I don't even need. Bad things inside of tank shoot tank. So obvious it hurts. I'll tell you what hurts. Toxic explosions! Neon may make people see the rainbows, but it's not the rainbows inside those reactors. My god, you would actually go through with it, wouldn't you? Please, I'll do anything. Just do not shoot the reactors. You're making the right choice. What is it exactly you need from me? I want to know how to best disrupt the synthesis process. Maybe sabotage those reactors over there, without killing us all. Is that something you can tell me how to do? There's a fail-safe system you can activate inside the reactor room. It empties the tanks, basically shuts everything down. You'll need these biocells to do it. All right. What about the codes? The code to get into the reactor room is 7851. Inserting the biocells will bring up the reactor terminal. Same code. 
The only thing I can't help you with is the lasers. That part is up to you. Biocells, painkillers, do something for right ourselves. over there. Oh, great. My favorite hog. You want to buy? Yes, good choice. I'm good for now. By now, you won't have to come back. Daz is the man. He'll set you up. Wonderful. To remember to look into that. Damn thing is always breaking. Go oh, up, man. That's okay, Dad. Sally or Jelly is going to say something? Yeah, I know. It's been closed for yeah. ages. Maybe a year or more. Right My niece there. loves those little marionettes they used to have. The ones that look like dogs. I was going to get one for her birthday. You could get her a real dog. No. She's an irresponsible little idiot. Trusting her with a piece of wood is as far as I would ever go. Looks like more overtime.
access granted. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Granted. Problems? Nothing I can't handle. We're just waiting on chicane. So tell me about this new lead then. The Intellicam footage. State police dropped it off this morning. Badly corrupted. But Cheng worked his magic and managed to recover some images. They show an org in a yellow hoodie, dropping bags where each bomb went off. You ran facial recognition? You got an ID? Couldn't see his face. But the bags are the same ones used by Talus Rucker and his aid workers in the Utilet complex. That's a stretch. Three bombings in Prague in six months, Jensen. All of them after the leader of Ark took up residence in that ghetto. Rucker needs to answer for these attacks. Here's your cane now. You're right on time. Agent Jensen was just agreeing that we need to bring Rucker in. Quick snatch and grab. Should be easy enough. So we've already decided he's guilty? We just need to talk to him on our terms. Not when he's surrounded by fanatics. Getting into Gollum isn't the problem. Reaching Rucker is. Ark territory is fiercely defended. No one sets foot in there. Not even the state police. 
they can't. Rucker wasn't forced into Gollum City. He bought his way in. Blackmail would be more apt. He threatened to go public with evidence of a humanitarian crisis, one that the United Nations Security Council had swept under the rug. Got them to force the Czech government to hand over part of the Utilek complex to him. A little bit of hush real estate, so to speak. He stays quiet and guarantees safety for himself and his followers. Smart. So how do I get in? I'd made a deal with an arc prospect named Tibor Sokol. Promised to get his family out of the complex, so long as he gets you past Ark's checkpoints. You trust him? We have to. It's that or nothing. Sokol will meet you at an apartment in the housing district. Number 237. Any questions? You really believe Ark is responsible for these attacks? For all of them? Ark has had the means, motive, and opportunity every time. Even Dubai? Rucker and the Coalition are still confined to Gollum City. They have a heavy police presence keeping an eye on them. Gollum isn't a concentration camp. You grease the right palms, you can get the papers you need to come and go. I find that hard to believe. So get me the evidence to prove otherwise. Get to tell us, Rucker, and bring him in, Agent. You ask me, Rucker sounds more like a savvy politician than a terrorist. These days, the lines tend to be blurred. But Rucker was a highly respected doctor, with no military training. What am I missing here? Rucker is a man of deeply held convictions, with an unshakable belief in his own righteousness. Doesn't take much to push a man like that to terrorism. Man's a zealot. He's a suspect. Just bring him in. Let's get this over with. Let me know when you've got Rucker. Goddamn, Jensen. Every time I look at you, I can't believe the amount of jewelry you've got on. Tell me, how's that aftermarket shit working out for you? Never better. Maybe you should reconsider. What with that limp? No. I like my limp. Keeps me honest. You ready to light out? You might only back up on this one. Before we leave, I'd like to know you've actually got my back. Trust me. I flew ten years in the SAAF and five in the private sector moving corporate heads. And in all that time, I've never lost a fare. How many years with TF-29? Two. Which is a year and a half longer than you, from what I understand. So you want to keep talking resumes, waste more of our time? Or will you trust me to get the job done? Let's do this. Good. Strap in. 